All right, cold air is still making its way into central North Carolina at this time of year, but maybe you've noticed we don't have as many cold days as in years past. Well, I have noticed that, sort of, since I've been here. CBS 17 Storm Team Meteorologist Rachel Dunson explains uh, that our cold snaps are getting shorter and what that means for us. You've heard the story before. Our winters are getting warmer. In fact, in the Raleigh-Durham area, our winters have warmed more than four degrees since 1970. The average winter temperature has been warmer than any other period since our records really started, at least for North Carolina as a whole, back in 1895. But it's not just the overall winters getting warmer that's the problem. Our cold snaps are getting shorter, too. A cold snap means a number of days in a row colder than the average high temperature. Since 1970, across the country, cold snaps are getting shorter by an average of six days. Here in the Triangle, our snaps are shorter by eight days. This may not seem like a big deal, but if you like getting outside, cold snaps can help keep insects at bay. There are mosquitoes that are uh, active during the winter as adults. They kind of rest while it's cool. And if you get a warm day, they'll kind of come out and start being active again. If you pair those shorter cold snaps with our warming winter temperatures, it means less snowpack in the North Carolina mountains. And some crops that need a string of cool days to produce the best yield won't get it. It may be nice running your heat less during the winter, but warmer winters and fewer cold days show this change is not stopping. It represents something real happening to the climate system. It's not just part of the random fluctuations that we would uh, normally experience. In Raleigh, meteorologist Rachel Dunzing, CBS 17.